What a trip. Dog will not, he can't get close enough. What do you want? You need to leave. So we're here at Garland High School right now. We're looking for a ghost because Apparently a girl died in the cafeteria, and we're trying to find her. So she was a big bitch. She was a dance. Yeah, and... So they say she's wearing this long, flowy dress. Looks kind of ethereal or something. Yeah, Ethereal's but... Ethereal? You know, like, ghosty or angel-y. Oh. I don't know, but... So, we're trying to find something, and we don't know what we're trying to find exactly. And... <clears throat> so, we think... We see down here, obviously, because this is where the hell the dance is. <coughs> and... And oh, what, what the hell was that? Oh my god. What, what was that noise? Did you hear it? Did you hear that? Oh my god, help! What? 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 Oh my god, what is that? What? Did you see it? No! Oh, 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 What? What is that? Oh my. What you're seeing has yet to be explained. This ancient Egyptian statue appears to be spinning on its own, as seen in time-lapse footage from the Manchester Museum. The nearly 4,000-year-old statue has been part of the museum's collection for 80 years and has never moved, until recently. Ancient Egyptians believe this type of statuette could act as a vessel for spirits, but the exhibit's curator thinks even the ancient Egyptians would have been surprised by the strange occurrence. Some logical explanations could be vibrations from cars outside or foot traffic in the museum, but that doesn't explain why it moves in a perfect circle. Whatever the answer, the phenomenon is sure to draw more visitors to the exhibit. Felipe Maya, CBS News, dot com. This is my mommy's room. This is downstairs. This is um, Oh my god. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.